Hi friends, it's me. I'm back again. I'm Tanta and I know you don't always see my face. Sometimes I show my face, but I am here to read your story. I'm late, but I am doing a story in the dark time at night when you're probably sleeping. And so this story today is a National Geographic Kids book. It's also Scholastic, and the title of it is what? What do you think? What is that a picture of? That's right, that's a frog. And so this is called or titled Frogs. And this one is written by Elizabeth Carney. And this is what we call like a chapter book. That means that it's gonna talk about different topics. Okay, so the first one is going to happen on page four, and it's called Splash. That's the one I'm going to read now. Then I'll come back and I'll read Croak, and then Frog Food, and then Every Size and Color, and then Watch Out, and then Frog Babies, and the last one will be Toads Are Frogs Too. And then these are just really pictures for these two. For us to look at is called Super Frogs and Picture Glossary. So today we're going to read from page four until that chapter ends, which is very short, and it's called Splash. So let's go with that. Splash. Let me move this light. You see that light on that book? I'm trying to move it so that it's not in your way and you can see the picture really good. Let me see. Oh boy. Okay, there we go. I think. I think that's better. So can you see that? That's a nice frog. It's called a Pacific Chorus Frog. And then it says Splish Splash. What is that sound? What is hopping and jumping around? What loves to swim? What loves to eat bugs? It's a frog. Can you hop like a frog? Frogs live all over the world except Antarctica. Frogs usually live in wet places. They like rivers, lakes, and Ponds. This one is a marsh frog. This one is a Andean marsupial, marsupial frog. This one is a red-eyed tree frog. And this one is a bullfrog. It says, but some frogs live in trees. Some even live in the desert. Frogs can be found all over the world, wherever they live, that's their habitat. And so these are the different frogs. When you see this paper clip right here, that means it's time for a new chapter. So I'm not gonna read this one until the next time. So let's go over the story just one more time because I needed to tell you what types of frogs they are and I just want to make sure you heard this story really good. So it says, splish, splash, what is that sound? What is hopping and jumping around? What loves to swim and what loves to eat bugs? It's a frog. Can you hop like a frog? Frogs live all over the world except Antarctica. Frogs usually live in wet places. They like rivers, lakes, and ponds. But some frogs live in trees. Some even live in their desert. Frogs can be found all over the world. Wherever they live, that's their habitat. And so this is the end of our chapter. And you know what a frog says, don't you? A frog says, moo. No, that's a cow. A frog says, Ribbit, you got it. That's what it says. Ribbit, ribbit. 
Okay, so we have some frogs. And the next time when we come back, we will read the next chapter. I hope you enjoyed that one. And I will see you tomorrow. I'm going to read one every day until we finish this little book. Because it's not that long. And I'll just give you a piece at a time. And until then, you know what I want you to do. I want you to be good. And I want you to be kind. And I'll see you the next time. Bye-bye.